Is it time to buy or sell Bed Bath & Beyond? Stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Bed Bath & Beyond. Our initial report was published on our website on Friday, April 21, 2023, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since February 7, 2023, our system has ranked Bed Bath & Beyond. As a sell candidate, giving it a score of minus 4.09. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. The stock experienced a loss of minus 90.25%. This translates to an average loss of minus 1.74% per day since it was listed as sell candidate. The stock lies in the lower of a very wide and falling trend in the short term, and this may normally pose a very good buying opportunity. If the lower trend floor at dash $0.309 is broken, it will firstly indicate a stronger fall rate. The current three-month trend suggests a potential minus 51.56% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 100% and 411.03%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a minus 75.12% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between minus 100% and 205.2%. This translates to a price range of $0 to 90 cents after a year. Our latest daily update for Bed Bath & Beyond includes the headline, Volatile Ride for Bed Bath & Beyond Incorporated Stock Price on Friday moving between $0.280 and $0.370. The Bed Bath & Beyond Incorporated Stock Price fell by minus 2.17% on the last day, Friday, April 21, 2023, from $0.300 to $0.294. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 32.14% from a day low at $0.280 to a day high of $0.370. The price has fallen in 6 of the last 10 days and is down by minus 5.08% for this period. Volume fell on the last day along with the stock, which is actually a good sign as volume should follow the stock. On the last day, the trading volume fell by minus 5 million shares and in total, 332 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $97.50 million. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $30, and the lowest price was $0.233. Currently, the price is 99.02%, or $29.71, below the 52-week high, and 99.46%, or $53.61, below the all-time high on January 27, 2021 when the price reached $53.90. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets On Wednesday, January 11, 2023, Wedbush set a price target of 1. On Wednesday, January 11, 2023, Wedbush set a price target of 1. On Wednesday, January 11, 2023, Wedbush set a price target of 1. On Friday, January 6, 2023, UBS set a price target of 1.5. On Friday, January 6, 2023, UBS set a price target of 1.5. Analysts have given Bed Bath & Beyond. Stock a general buy rating. They rate the P.E. ratio as neutral and price to book as neutral. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a neutral rating. The following signals have been identified for Bed Bath & Beyond. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the 3-month Moving Average Convergence Divergence MACD. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. The Bed Bath & Beyond Incorporated stock hold sell signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a more negative forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general sell signal from the relation between the two signals where the long-term average is above the short-term average. On corrections up, there will be some resistance from the lines at $0.311 and $0.728.
A breakup above any of these levels will issue by signals. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Wednesday, April 19, 2023, and so far it has fallen minus 36.75%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Volume fell together with the price during the last trading day and this reduces the overall risk as volume should follow the price movements. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, by signal. Pivots, sell signal 3 days ago. Bollinger, by signal 368 days ago. Short-term moving average, sell signal 3 days ago. Long-term moving average, sell signal 52 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 47 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart we see. Short moving average, sell signal 3 days ago. The long-term moving average, by signal 54 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 151 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Bed Bath & Beyond Bed Bath & Beyond Incorporated finds support from accumulated volume at $0.280 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock may move very much during the day, volatility, and with a very large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band this stock is considered to be very high risk. During the last day, the stock moved $0.0900 between high and low, or 32.14%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 33.19%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for Bed Bath & Beyond, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price-to-earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per share earnings. A negative P-E ratio means the company has negative earnings or is losing money. Even established companies experience down periods, often due to factors beyond their control. However, consistently negative P-E ratios may signal insufficient profit and possible bankruptcy risks. In other news, the next earnings report for Q2 2023 is expected on Sept 27, 2023. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Bed Bath & Beyond. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Bed Bath & Beyond is at $0.300. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, Bed Bath & Beyond encounters its first support level at $0.280. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for Bed Bath & Beyond from multiple analyst sources is buy. Let's take a look at some recent insider trades. On February 10, 2023, Upadi conducted an insider sell of 1,565 shares of common stock, 1 cent par value per share. On February 10, 2023, Sir Helmara conducted an insider sell of 776 shares of common stock, 1 cent par value per share. On January 24, 2023, Flatten Carroll conducted an insider buy of zero shares of. On January 20, 2023, Lombard Shelley conducted an insider sell of zero shares of common stock, one cent par value per share. On January 20, 2023, Shah Minesh conducted an insider sell of zero shares of common stock, one cent par value per share. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be negative with a ratio of minus 2.768. Overall, insiders purchased 1,545,412 shares and sold 1,397,073 shares in the last 100 trades. We have a negative evaluation for this stock and no stop loss has been set.
is Bed Bath & Beyond. Stock a good buy? Bed Bath & Beyond Incorporated holds several negative signals and is within a very wide and falling trend, so we believe it will still perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. We therefore hold a negative evaluation of this stock. We have upgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a strong sell to a sell candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For trading on Monday, April 24, we expect Bed Bath & Beyond to open up $0.0210 and start trading at $0.315. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.